I painted pockets of this jeans one year ago and this is one of the most stupid and boring designs I have ever created. So why I did it? I saw an artist on Instagram who painted pockets of shorts and the image of these shorts went viral. And then I was thinking that maybe if I will paint pockets and if I will post video, I will get a lot of likes, I will get a lot of followers. And when it didn't happen, I promised myself that I will never ever again paint something stupid, which I don't like, which is not me. And now such painted pockets are the new trend. Hey guys! Welcome to my art fashion channel. I'm Daria, the artist who paints on clothes. And let me explain you why I'm so frustrated about this new trend, painting on pockets trend. Because I've been here on YouTube for more than a year and I've created about 90 videos and all my videos about painting on clothes. I painted on t-shirts, I painted on sweatshirts, on hoodies, on denim jackets, on jeans, on capes, on bag. I've made a lot of DIY videos to show you how you can customize your clothes. I've made educational videos, how to choose fabric paints, how to choose brushes, how to avoid mistakes in painting on clothes. I show different designs, I show different techniques. And I'm struggling so much to get views and to get new subscribers because this kind of art is not popular kind of art. People do not search how to paint on clothes, how to paint on t-shirts. And I guess YouTube just doesn't know how to suggest these videos because YouTube doesn't know who would like to watch such kind of content, I think. And imagine, I'm struggling, 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 and I'm hearing that there's a new trend, painting on clothes trend, that people paint on their jeans, and it's trendy. And I got so excited that finally, because of this trend, my channel will have a chance to be discovered, that people will search, people will see my videos, people will see my art, and I looked closer to this trend. And I saw just pockets. People paint on their pockets. And people paint just clouds, clouds, and SpongeBob. And that is a trend. Why pockets? Why not a denim jacket, for example? There's a huge space on the back of a denim jacket. Perfect for art. <laughs> Wait, I will show you a denim jacket which I painted one year ago. You can paint on the back, you can paint on the sleeves, you can paint on the front. And this jacket was basic white jacket. And look on it now. And also, most of these people who paint on their pockets, they don't even use right paints, they use acrylic paints, which most likely will crack or peel off or wash off after a couple of washing. And then these people will say that we try to paint on clothes, but it's impossible because paints are cracking. And here we go again. <laughs> Nobody knows about this kind of art. And I think that people just don't realize what kind of clothing you can create with fabric paints, how many possibilities you have with fabric paints. So I decided to make this video as a presentation. I will show you artworks. But not my artworks. My artworks you can see here on YouTube or on my Instagram I'm there Dial Creative. I will show you artworks of other artists. And as I said, this kind of art is not popular. And there are not so many artists, English-speaking artists, who paint on clothes. But in Russia, this kind of art is quite popular. Many artists paint their own clothes. People know about this kind of art, people buy customized hand paint clothing, so artists do not struggle to sell such clothing, as I'm struggling. <laughs> so I will show you these amazing artworks on clothes and you will see how amazing hand painted clothing can be and you will see that pockets are the most boring place to paint on. <laughs> But before showing you this hand-painted clothing, let me tell you something. The main problem with Russian artists that many of them paint other artists' artworks on clothes. 
And for me, it's stealing. It's a wrong thing to do. So I tried to find artworks, which I think are original ideas. But I'm not sure. So if you will see some artwork which belongs to some other artists, just know that I don't support such kind of art. It's wrong thing to do. So let's start with denim jackets because hand-painted denim jackets are so popular in Russia. People love to wear hand-painted denim jackets there. And first denim jacket is so beautiful. Artist painted Michelangelo's David sculpture on jacket, but in a creative way. So you can see these pink stripes, you can see ornament on the upper part of jacket. Also artist painted this ornament on the front of a jacket. And this jacket just designed very well. I love everything about it. Idea, design, composition, technique, uh, artistic skills. So amazing jacket. Next one is also a famous artwork painted on jacket, the birth of Venus, but in a creative way. And it reminds me about pop art, uh, this <laughs> star on the nipple and also bananas, sleeves are painted, flames on the sleeves and also design on the front of a jacket. So creative and so beautiful jacket. Next one is a landscape and it is not the clouds on pockets of jeans. <laughs> beautiful landscape art, sunset, palms, I love it. This one is so beautiful and I'm not sure if it's original art. Maybe it's something about this rock band Led Zeppelin, but the colors. So amazing. And if you wear such jacket, everybody will ask you, where did you buy it? I love the colors. So beautiful. This one is so amazing. Michael Jackson uh, portraits on the new jacket. But I love this background. Artists create this rain effect. Amazing, amazing jacket. This one is so beautiful too. Freddie Mercury jacket, Freddie Mercury portrait and also this quote on the upper part. All together, just amazing design. This one is Freddie Mercury jacket too. But I don't like background. I would add more expression to this design, this background. I would make some brush strokes, I would splatter some paint because it's Freddie Mercury. But it's amazing, of course. Here I love the background. Paint, splatters and brush strokes and Frida portrait, of course, amazing. So beautiful jacket. I love it. And here the example of easy design. Uh, you need just uh, black paint. You can use spray fabric paint to create this uh, background. Or you can paint it with brush. And then you will write whatever you want. Whatever you wish you can write. Everybody can write. So everybody can create such jacket. And as you can see, it's amazing. This one, also so beautiful, white denim jacket, aluminum portrait and graffiti style. So beautiful and so eye-catchy, I love it. This one is animal design. I love to paint animals on clothes, but I love the color. This pink color on the black denim jacket, so beautiful. And this one is also example of easy design and all you need is to have fun write something splatter paint make brush strokes doodle so fun and easy and one more i want to show you wait this one not so complicated design but i love it but i would splatter more white paint to create more stars but of course all artists paint in different ways so, as you can see, such amazing jackets can be created with fabric paints. And that should be trend. That is what should be trendy, <laughs> not pockets. And now I will show you all other kind of clothing. T-shirts, sweatshirts and so on. And first one is black t-shirt with a lips design and it's not so hard design, not so hard to create it. I would splatter a bit more red paint. <laughs> 
but it's just me of course but design is so beautiful and so colorful i love it next one so beautiful i love the idea i love such designs with an idea and i'm not sure is it original artwork of this artist but such design just perfect for sweatshirt for hoodie for t-shirt <laughs> next one is dress and as you can see bird painted on the dress uh, here and perfect place for a bird <laughs> along the neckline and I had such idea and I think to create such video how to paint bird uh, on the t-shirt along the neckline and look on these paint splatters they are huge how did she create them I love these paint splatters I need to think how to create such paint splatters definitely amazing and this design is painted on the back of a romper yes you can paint on the romper as well and so creative I love this design and it is painted on the romper and animal design I love to paint roaring tigers roaring lions and as you can see, artist made these brush strokes and paint splatters, and you can feel the fears of this animal. Amazing. And this t-shirt is mind-blowing. <laughs> and also, I'm not sure if it's original artwork of this artist, but I love the idea and perfect design for t-shirt. An artist created a watercolor effect a background mixed fabric paints with water. I love technique, artistic skills, idea, design, mind-blowing. This one is an example of how you can paint on colorful clothes, uh, colorful t-shirts or sweatshirts or hoodies. And I love colors, I love design, I love that rose is so big. And by the way, my next video will be on how to paint rose on clothes, so stay tuned. This one is so beautiful, artwork on the white hoodie and I love to paint on white hoodies and design is so beautiful, idea is amazing and uh, artist created this background with brush strokes, I love this hoodie. And this one is so lovely and cute, colors, design, animal design, I love it. This one, also beautiful t-shirt with tropical leaves. I would add, of course, background and paint splatters <laughs> to this design. This one is so beautiful design and I love how it continues on the sleeve. And here artists also uh, used watercolor effect technique, mixed fabric paints with water and also paint splatters you can see. I love it. Next one, Joker design. And I love the composition idea of this composition is beautiful i love it so creative next one amazing hand painted t-shirt and i'm not sure uh, is it original artwork or no but i love how artists play it with techniques you can see here with a colorful technique brush strokes lines paint splatters so beautiful and this is an example how you can customize your jeans, but in a creative way. You can paint beautiful floral design on the front of your jean. And this one is also easy design. Everybody can make it. You can paint your flag, your country flag on a t-shirt with brush strokes. So beautiful. And yeah, now you can see what kind of beautiful clothes can be created. What kind of different techniques can be used. What kind of interesting designs can be painted on clothes? And I hope that such clothing will be trendy. I hope that creativity and art will be in trend. <laughs> anyway, thanks to all my subscribers who support my channel in the hard times. I really appreciate your support. And if you are new here, consider subscribing to my channel to spread the message about art fashion and to make it popular. And I hope to see you all on the next video. Fashion is art. Bye bye.